Did you know how much your head can weight? Of course, that depends how intelligent and smart you are, right? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding and I'm gonna get back to that soon. Did you know that your body is designed to have your ears over your shoulders, over your hips, to have a better straight line with your whole spine? This is provides you an optimal performance and supports your head in a natural position above your spine. Hello, Pilatatoes! Yes, this is a made-up word in Portuguese, which is means Pilates practitioner or Pilates lovers. I am Carolina here and welcome to Pilates Controlly channel. That's why you guys are Pilatatoes, because the name of the channel it is Pilates, right? After all. And anyhow, I am working a new series for you who spend a lot of time with your devices or maybe if you drive a lot as well. And this exercise you can do at home, at work, on your breaks, or if you're driving a lot, if you stop by to get gas, or anywhere at the beach, at the park, outdoors, anywhere you have a little extra time. And those are very quick and fast. And the series it's called dun, 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 The Tech Neck. I know, right? Well, if you work in a computer all day or be spending a lot of time into your devices, right? Or if you're driving a lot, right? This is the tech neck. So your neck goes forward a lot. And what happens? Your spine has to take care of that. And later on, you can pay the price. No fun at all. And the study shows that every inch that our head goes forward, it adds up 10 pounds extra into your whole spine. So what does it mean? If your head weighs already 10 pounds, and if you had three inches forward with your neck, that would be end up what? Do the math, guys. And that would have a lot of pressure and strain into your neck muscles. And you wonder why you have back pain or a bad posture into your pictures? We can fix that. Also, healthy care professionals recognize that for the head posture contributes for a lot of headaches and muscle spasms that we have on the neck and shoulder area. That tightness, right? The more you lean forward, the more strain you put onto your neck muscles. And the vertebrae onto your cervical spine, which is your neck, it's very delicate and it has a big job to do of carrying your head already, right? Imagine four times more of the weight of your own head. They support your head, protecting your spinal cord and allow your head and neck movements. So it's a very important job to take care of these vertebrates and protect them. Well, you can apply these tips anywhere into your daily basis, being more mindful of your body and taking care of it. And I hope you enjoyed these quick tips and notice that you can do it anywhere. Easy peasy, right? Please comment below how you felt after you've done it. And also don't forget to hit the like, subscribe on the channel and share with your friends and families who can benefit from this content. And we'll see you next time. Ciao.